what's up everyone and welcome back to this youtube channel today in this video i'm going to show you how to download and install python on your windows machine so let's start open any web browser i'm going to use mozilla firefox and in here let's go to google.com and i'm going to search for download python and i'm going to choose the first link which says download python and belongs to this website uh, python.org so let's click on this link and we are taken to the official website of Python. By the time I'm making this video, the latest version of Python is Python 3.11.0. So I'm going to download this version of Python. So let's click on this download button. And as you can see, the download has started. After the download is complete, I'm going to click on it, minimize my web browser, and we are taken to this prompt. So right here is saying install python 3.11.0 and we have two options here we can either accept the default install now and it's going to install our python installation on this path but uh, we can also choose the custom installation but before that we should also check this add python.exe to path what this will do is it will add the path to our python installation in our environment variables so that you can get the access to python.exe uh, uh, from your command line so let's click on this custom installation now and in here let's leave everything as it is and click on next and inside here we can also select this uh, install python 3.11 for all users uh, yeah let's leave everything as it is you can also choose these two options as well but i'm going to leave them as they are and i'm also going to change this path just c drive slash python 311 that's because the version of my python installation is 3.11 so i'm going to keep it like this after that we can click on install and click on yes and the installation will begin now as you can see it says setup was successful now let's click on close and to check if the python was installed successfully what you can do is go to search box and search for command line so here you can see command prompt and click on it and in here we'll just type python and if you see something like this the python and then the version of the python then it means that the installation was successful and you can now uh, run python on your computer but if for some reason you don't see this thing and you get an error or you are redirected to microsoft store then uh, what you need to do is you need to go to you need to go to the folder uh, in my case it was c drive where I installed uh, my Python. So you can see Python 3.11. Let's click on it. And what I'll do is I'll just copy the path of my installation folder and close this folder. And then I'm going to go to the search box again and search for environ. And I'm going to click on this thing, edit the system environment variables. So let's click on it and here we have the environment variables click on it in here what you need to do is you need to click on this path and if you don't see this thing here python 311 slash scripts or python 311 uh, then then that means that uh, you don't have the uh, path entries in your environment variables and in that case you can click on this new and paste in the uh, folder path that we just copied and hit enter we also need to add this scripts as well so we can again click on new paste in the path then slash then scripts enter click on ok click on ok and ok now let's close the old command prompt and open it again and now if you type in python you should see this thing uh, on your on your command prompt now let's see if it really works so if i say one plus two you can see now the python is working so i get three i can also say print hello and it's going to print hello i can also import random you can see it it didn't give any error so this means that everything is working perfectly so this is how you can install python on your windows machine i hope you find this video helpful give this video a thumbs up if you have any questions do comment down below I'll see you in the next one. Till then, peace out.